Hey, what is up guys? My name is Nat and I just wanted to make a quick video on how to do a girl voice. You might have seen a couple of my reactions in the past. Yeah, what's up? How are you? <laughs> God damn. I'm really good. How are you? I'm really good, Nat. How are you? I'm really good, bro. How are you? Oh shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, bro. I do actually not use a voice changer, which is surprising. So I'm actually going to teach you how to do it without a voice changer. I actually believe that voice changes are a lot less effective than actual impersonations. So if you're going to be able to voice troll people, I recommend just learning the impression, whether it's a uh, Stewie or if it's Shrek or if it's SpongeBob or even a girl impression, you should learn how to do the voice. Also, there's a more scientific video out on YouTube right now. If you guys want to go check that out, I'll leave that in the description. So if you guys want a more exact procedure on how to do it, um, go check that out. But without further ado, guys, I'm going to do the best I can to teach you how to do a girl voice and even try to get you more into like a gay voice or James Charles voices. Uh, some people like to refer to it. So uh, yeah. But before the video starts, guys, I'd really appreciate it if you subscribe to the channel and like the video. Uh, it helps me out more than you know. So the first thing I do if I'm learning an accent or an impression is look at the way they talk. How I got my girl voice is watching actually Mean Girls. Some people are able to pick up impressions pretty easily, but with Georgina George, it was kind of easier for me. Just pay attention to the way she talks and how she structures her sentences. My first boyfriend, Kyle, who was totally gorgeous, but then he moved to Indiana. And Janice was like weirdly jealous of him. Like if I would blow her off to hang out with Kyle, she'd be like, why didn't you call me back? And I'd be like, why are you so obsessed with me? So for the first part, we're gonna be working on our feminine voice. So for that, you can really do it in a guy or a girl voice. It works either way. So for me, it'd be like, oh my God, we went to the mall and then we went to the store and then we got some shoes and then we talked to this cute guy. He's like adorable. And then your goal there is to just kind of learn how she talks and like, you know, just, just be fun with it, you know, have fun with it. Another thing for that voice is to be more energetic and playful because that's what you're going for. The next part of learning how to do the voice is learning how to change your voice from a higher and a lower pitch. And so what I do if I want to get to that tone is I pretend I'm at the dentist. What you want to do is open your mouth and just say ah and go up and down in volume. So it's like ah, ah, ah. So you're already up here and it's pretty wild and you're higher in tone, but you're also talking. So from there you combine both of part one and two into the same thing. And you're up here. It's like, oh my God. So you're already talking like a girl. So it's all about that. And th that's what you're looking for. And from here, you just have to make it your own. So for me, it'd, it'd be like toning it down. So it's more like this. It's like you're just kind of like putting it a little bit more down in tone, but it's still up here. And after that, it's all about just practicing and just showing everybody what you got. A lot of it just comes with your own personalization and your own kind of taste to it. Um, once you get used to a girl voice, you can add on different stuff to it. So you can add on accents to it. You can practice it. All it takes is just practice, practice, practice. That, that's what I tell everybody. But anyway, guys, if I helped you at all, please let me know down in the comments or DM me on social media. My links will be down below. Besides that, I hope you all have a wonderful day or night or wherever you're going.